don't stop to talk. I keep stopping with a nine on my waistline. Got 16 shots and I don't waste mine. Never vest, cause I dress with a bulletproof vest. Try to test, I leave a bloody ass mess. Drop it sob, got connections with the mob. Bank jobs, plenty niggas I'll rob. Blood stains all my valleys, suck a guy rowdy. So I shot him in the alley. Pump his face full of dum dums. Then left him for the cast of rats in a bump. Yo, a lot of suckers hate me with a passion. Cause they know I can catch him when not, and I ain't flashing. I got a crazy big posse, I should've said crew of niggas that belong in the zoo. Watch you spit up blood when you get hit up. Run in the head, making sure you don't get up. This is what happens and nobody can't stop it. Crackheads searching a dead man's pockets. Streets are filled with brothers that kill like Illville. They murdered before and they still will. Posse's ruin a drug war. It's unbelieving. Death before a poor. Shooting galleries for a rich man's salary. Pockets are back, they need dough with low calories. I got an order for another man's slaughter. Run him up the bags like his ass full of water. I had to run up in a kid's crib for something he did. I didn't dig a little big. Anyway, I didn't have it. In fact, not a little faggot. Scrolling with maggots. Try to bother the neighborhood godfather. And I burn your ass up like lava. Took the lob, the suckers that try to get lava. Never caught it. I want to tell her a lie. Shannon, you brain the van, everybody's wearing gloves on their hand. Strictly army suits and long black Timberland boots. I want us all to roll like troops. See, now we get the roll on them. Cause the punk little sucker they shot up came and told on them. I want to bags up too. Cause ain't no telling of what he might do to my crew. Shoot a sucker at point blank range. If he seems like he's acting strange, dump the chump chain. Go straight for the green and the jewels. And we can even take niggas' tools. Shoot the killer, don't leave no witness. The bobs try to get live you with this. Snatch up the top man and start slapping him. And put a cap on him. Just start wrapping him up. And back, no time to shiver. Stop on the bridge and deliver bodies into the river. Next stop, blow away that pain in the ass cop. The one to keep getting niggas knocked. Put it into his shit. He ain't about making collars. The crooked ass rookie wants dollars. My man rides on the rooftop waiting to snipe. Two bullets went right through his windpipe. Cold blood shot down, taking his very last breath. Left to bleed to death. Skip the job, suckers that try to get live. Yo, I want to tell him a lie. Hello and welcome, if anyone's here. I don't think anyone's here, but that's fine. If anyone's out there, welcome anyway. Let's see. I might have to adjust uh, audio a little bit on the fly here. But yeah, that's alright. Okay, let's uh, switch scenes here. And, uh,. We're not gonna have music playing in the background for this. I should've let, should've like faded that out instead of just stopping it like that. It's quite unprofessional. But anyway, anyway, <laughs> let's get into it. We're gonna play some uh, Red Dead Revolver, which I have not played properly since 2005. Yeah, so really long time. Really, really long time. So it'll be fun going back to it. I haven't played it. In so long. Uh, the last time I did play it was probably about four years ago, but that was the multiplayer. I haven't played the single player in so long, but uh, I really liked it back in the day. So it'll be interesting to see if it's any good now or if it's just hasn't aged well at all. But uh, yeah, let me just get up, chat. Hey, Retro. Welcome. And uh, yeah, haven't even picked my language yet. This is like the very first screen you see. So yeah, this is as fresh as it, it can get. And uh, yeah, might need to change audio as I go and stuff like that. But hopefully it's all it's all okay. Um, there's no audio at the moment anyway. So 
Hey gaming dude, what's up? We'll watch this. Why not? A lot of the music in this game was licensed, if I remember correctly. That's right. You you played as all these characters at some point. But just like for a level kind of thing. Yeah, make sure you get the name right before you send give people points. <laughs> Is retro done with my channel? Is this it? Is this the end? Anyway, that was a nice little uh, intro there. Nah, oh, okay, just wondering. It just seemed like you were giving up there, giving away all, your, all the points. Um, what am I going to do here? The journal, I think this is just backstory, yeah. You unlock more of that stuff as you go on. And that the showdown's the Molly Fair. We'll go on the options here. I kinda wanna play it like that, to be honest. I think that I think four by three looks better. I know I'll have black bars at the edge, but hopefully uh it's not too annoying. Um We'll turn subtitles on. Yes, please. We'll change name. Player options. Um, do I want dual targeting inverted? Maybe not actually. But usually I play uh, inverted, you know, with targeting and stuff. Okay, no problem. Hey Retro, thanks for stopping by. I know, yeah, it's crazy early for you. It's like 8 in the morning, half 8 in the morning over there, so. Yeah, it's all good. It's all good. Yeah, four hours, forty-six minutes already. Crazy. All right, that's, that looks all good. We'll finally start this. A change player would just be profile. A young Nate Harlow built the cabin a ways from Bear Mountain, partly to get some distance from the Red Wolf tribes after some folks weren't happy. Yet. About him marrying Falling Star. Oh dear. What the frog is this? What do you think it is? Nico. That's right. He's like a kid at this point, basically. Not quite a kid, but you know what I mean.
That's weird. That's is. I thought that looked a little bit like a PlayStation 4 controller. I guess it's not. It just looked like it for a second. Okay. Um, yeah, I'll take a quick training session because I haven't played this in so long. Here with the bullseye. Hey, Hack, welcome. Take out those bottles and pounds there on the fence. Oh, right, over here. I was gonna say, where the hell is that? <laughs> I thought everything was supposed to be alright, man. The kids down by the river, go get them. I do remember enjoying the combat in this game at the time. Like they're good at flinching and stuff when they're getting shot out and stuff, it's pretty fun. There you go, it's the end of the first level. Nice. Alright, so based on your performance you get um, upgrades, and I think Broken Creek, yeah that's a multiplayer level. And uh, I think you do use the money in between levels to buy stuff, if I remember correctly. I might have to turn down the volume slightly unless it's okay. Oh, easy there, 
uh, friend. <laughs> Come on over here. Come on now. It's too dangerous for a man to be walking around in these parts. I deal in weapons and goods, see? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, like, I like the sort of cartoony nature of all the characters in this game. Uh, let's see. See, this stuff doesn't actually get you anything, it's just stuff that unlocks in the journal that I showed in the menu. And that's just gets you a showdown character. And so does that. Um, I'll get the knife purely because it's actually. Oh, no, I didn't. Didn't even get a hit X instead of square. Oh well. <laughs> My aim is a bit potato at the moment. Use my wagon for cover. Yeah, there's, it's got a little bit of a cover system going on here. Need to get the rifle out, I think. There we go. Exciting. Yeah, I will learn how to do this. Pretty simple. Pretty easy. That's what he says. Uh, most of the characters in this game are multiplayer characters as well, and I know uh, that's what he says when you go to select them. Oh, thank you very much, Hugo, for the host. I appreciate that, that a lot. Thank you, homie. Come on, George. Does he even have a weapon? He does. I'm gonna say. It's not much of a boss battle, is it? <laughs> I just fuck up to the guy and shoot him. Hey, Houdini. Yes, this is a nice game. Well, I liked it back in the day. I enjoyed it. You know, you can get quite a handsome bounty for these fellas if you took them down to Sheriff O'Grady's in Widow's Patch. I'll be taking your cart. Uh, well, uh, sure, uh, whatever you say, bounty hunter. <laughs> what a goof. Not bad. I'll take it. Yeah, I really enjoyed this back in the day. I know most people... Well, I I noticed, like, online, most people never really play this game. They just played Red Dead Redemption. But, you know, the two games are very different. Um, yeah, I'll buy that. I should have bought that knife, actually. Um...
Yeah, I should have bought that knife. I didn't know it was going to be a one and done kind of thing, because if I go in the shop again, it's not there, you know what I mean? So, whatever. <laughs> There really isn't much of a story in this game, is there? There's a very basic one, but... It's basically a revenge tale, but... I like this uh, song a lot. I believe it was um, licensed from uh, an Italian horror movie. A lot of the music in this game was licensed from other stuff, other movies and stuff. Didn't get the, the opportunity to pick that up. Hey Maria, welcome, Sister Dandelion. The way some of the, the enemies have their own names reminds me of like um, Streets of Rage or something like that. Final Fight, those kinds of games. Is it Sister Dandelion's birthday today? Yeah, we will do the tutorial for this because I don't really remember how to do these. Back on the right analog stick, and then you press forward. Yeah, we'll definitely play some one point six together for sure. All right, <laughs> I was just making sure because Houdini used to feel his birthday man emotes, you know. <laughs> Excuse me. I was just making making sure, you know. Okay, I think I get the gist of this. And then you hit R1. Okay. I think I get the gist of it. It's the sort of thing that you learn better when you do it, rather than them painfully slowly explaining it to you. <laughs> yeah, I haven't played 1.6 in a very long time. Right in the dick. There we go, got myself a nice trophy there. Oh yeah, it's been a long time for me as well. I'm getting mad loot. Over $1,000.
Oh, here comes Jigolo. Chat is like a, it's like a program you can use to look at Twitch chats. Ugly Chris. He does live up to his name, that's for sure. Oh, I didn't get an excellent that time. Feels bad. Hello, Rizzo Cat. Welcome. Um. Yeah, we'll buy that shotgun. We'll buy that as well. It's only seven bucks. It's always good to buy a Bible, you know what I mean? It gives you good luck, so. Um, yes, please. I didn't, I forgot, completely forgot about the fact you have to repair your guns in between levels. That's something I completely forgot about. Okay. Uh, it's a long ride to Brimstone, but uh, I reckon I'll manage. Well, you're gonna have to, old man. Hey, mister, you heading to Brimstone, too? I reckon that's where everyone is heading. Always jobs at Brimstone. Me, I'm going to work for Carnaby Peabody. He's the manager of the Brimstone Bank and a real swell guy. I won't waste time talking to everyone if I don't have to. Maybe I have to. I don't remember. What you bothering me for? Sit back down. Well, he's obviously a bad guy. Good dialogue. Good cutscene, I should say. Alright. That's the end of that. See, I told you that guy was a dick. I just knew it. He's shaking like a shitting dog though, look at that. <laughs> I love the dramatic like music stings for these. It's pretty pretty entertaining. Oh shit, that's not what you're supposed to do. Yeah, I deserved to die there. That wasn't that wasn't very good. That was bad. Hey Ricardo. Oh, I have to do. Uh, can I just walk to the front and then walk back? No, I have to talk to these people. Oh my god! The best general store in the territories in Brimstone. I should know. I own it. Hey, Mister, you heading to Brimstone? Me, I'm going to. 
Mister, you could really use a hot bath. Okay. So rude. Do you, maybe I have to talk to him. What you bothering me? Yeah, there you go. That's what triggers it. I know it's rare, Ricardo. Most people didn't play this back in the day. I did, though. I was a fan of this game back in the day. But I haven't played it for many, many years. Right, can I skip that? Okay. Um, that's better. Pretend that was the way I did it last time. Does the main guy have whiskers? Yeah, he's a cat man. He's a cat. No. I think he has scars on his face. I think that's what that's supposed to be. Melee attack. Let's do it. Not very effective, but we got the job done. Yeah, um, Fry installed it. I don't think he's played it yet, though. It's been quite. Hey, Tragedy. Yeah, I really like this game back in the day. I was saying earlier though, not many people have seemed to have played it though. Oh yeah, what do you mean surprisingly fun, Ricardo? Then jump over that one. Yep, 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 yep. Yep, yep, yep. This is a fail. This is a fail. <laughs> it certainly is. I like the way it's like an arcade game. They give you a countdown to retry. Can I skip this? No. Alright, we've got it. See, did it take too long to explain that to you at the top there? What happened to that guy? He just disappeared. <laughs> he just fell off. Duck, no, duck. Yeah, but most of the Rockstar games back then were all pretty dope.
Yep, random guy. Thanks for saving me. Here, let me patch you up. He patched me up a bit just by staring into my soul. He's an awesome guy. There ain't no end to these desperados. The aiming feels a bit weird compared to modern games. I'll say that much. It's like it's quite sluggish compared to near games, you know. I'll I'll say that. Seems like they're all just getting on the train there. We'll definitely all play together, it'll be good fun. I'm looking forward to it. I can teach you guys everything about Half-Life. Maybe I should use my rifle more. Oh, I didn't know you could kick. Look at that. Kick him off. No, it doesn't really work like that. I don't know, the rifle's kind of weak. And it's slow. Like, weak and slow is not a good combination. I'm nearly dead, I shouldn't do it. Don't frog it up now. I'm not going to get an excellent because I took loads of damage. Oh, actually I did. Wow. I didn't deserve it though. Everyone here is a good student. I'm happy that I have good, responsible people in my chat. Yeah, we can do it, Houdini. Bartlett, I got your telegram. Mighty grateful to you. <laughs> I may have some work for you. Stop by my office later. <laughs> here's the little. I I barely remember this, but here's the little. The tiny little open world part where you can just kind of go around and I think there's a shop you can go to and you can talk to people like this 
And yeah, I don't remember what else is in here. Let's enter the bank and say hello to the bank. Good day to you, sir. Can't say. Hello there, sir. If you're looking to take out a mortgage. All right, you can uh, buy that, which is uh, a multiplayer level. I want to go and find like the general store. I'm sure they probably have weapons. There we go. Maybe not just weapons, but some sort of uh, something that I might find useful. What can I do for you, stranger? Ralph. A bedroll, no, 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 no. Actually, none of these things are useful at all. That's all just stuff to fill up your journal with. There's probably a trophy for filling up your journal. Um, let's see. Gun shop, that's more like it. I can get an upgraded version of that. Sure. Why not? There's actually nothing else here. I'm so disappointed with the shops here. Yeah. I'm sure um, you come back here later on and they have more stuff, but. We'll check out the saloon quickly. Take a shot. If I can. I don't know if that's possible. You look like you need a drink. What'll it be? I'll have a whiskey bottle, please. Not actually. Why would you buy a whiskey bottle? You know. A whiskey bottle but with no whiskey inside. That's not it's not a good deal, especially for nineteen bucks. If you're as good a bounty hunter as O'Grady says you are, you could help me with a couple of real outlaws wreaking havoc in my territory. It'd be worth a pretty penny to you. You might want to start with Pig John. Oh god, he sucks. Just be careful. He got a hankering for dynamite. Oh, you might want to keep your eyes out for some English fella. He don't know what a motley crew he keep in company with. Dynamite. Yeah, I'll buy that. Might come in useful at some point. Uh, we'll go with the rifle. See, that's still better, I think. That holds more ammo, but if I repair this, the stats on it are still way better. Yeah, I don't think anyone likes him for Excuse me. Excuse me, sir. I seem to have found myself in a most unfortunate situation. If you would be kind enough to help me. You ain't my problem. Indeed, sir. However, you might feel differently once you look behind you. This level sucks, by the way. I will probably struggle with this level later on, because this is um, this is one of those levels. Anyone that played this back in the day probably struggled with this. This is the wrong side of the tracks equivalent of Red Dead Revolver. Punching the little clown man. Whoa, 
They remind me of the grunts from Halo. And they're small and they say humorous stuff. the fear of clowns in the chat. The sensitivity on this is all over the place. That's probably by design, but yeah, it's hard to end with. It's very sensitive. I was never afraid of clients myself. They never scared me. I'm just gonna chase these guys down. Not him, he's my he's my friend, this guy. somewhere. This is the part of the level if it sucks. Um, so from memory, what you have to do, you have to kind of stealth attack him, like in the back, and that's done some, and you shoot him in the back. But if you don't do that, he just runs after you and blows you up, and that's horrible, absolutely horrible. Hey, Fred, welcome. So that's kind of the basic gist of what you have to do, but then he's running after me here and he's probably going to blow me up, we'll see. And it's hard to get an idea of where he is, I know he's over there somewhere, but like it's hard to lose sight of him or, you know, lose his uh, attention. Because it's not really like a proper stealth game. See, so yeah, I'm gonna die here soon. There he is. 
There we go. That was a lot harder when I was a kid. <laughs> Assistance whatsoever, do not hesitate to call upon me. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a certain debt to collect from Professor Perry and his circus crew. Good day to you. Nice. So here's our first level where we actually play a different character. Yep, I got a trophy. Yeah, most people didn't play it for <laughs> Thanks, Blue Dandelion. I don't even know what it was for, but... Here's more clowns. I'm doing well. Just chilling, having a nice chill stream. But yeah, I'm doing pretty good today. I like his dead eye. It's different compared to reds. You just press a button and he automatically like locks on a hundred times. It's pretty good. These clowns are pretty annoying. Oh yes, very chill, good vibes. That wasn't very nice, Jack. Don't bet on making it out again. Over the lips and past the girls. Look out, Jack. Here I come. He teleports if I remember right, yeah. We won the war. We'll kill this guy for This will be a little bit difficult for me because I hear audio slightly delayed. So if she says, you know, he's over here, it will be a little bit delayed. <laughs>
I would love for one of these clients to drop some health. <clears throat> hey, Real Tech Nine, welcome. There we go, there's some health. <laughs> Legless folk. There we go. He's dead. So sorry, old Thank you for the fake bets. Sorry, so I appreciate it. Incredible! You saved my life. All in a day's work. I only wish it were more financially. I appreciate it, Fro. Well, and Fred. Mister, get yourself a little money. That's all you're worried about. Then Maybe someday. Someone with your talent could pick up five thousand dollars in gold without even trying. Pray do tell, young lady, and I would be forever in your debt. There's a sharpshooter competition in Brimstone. Winner takes all. Shouldn't be a problem for such a fine marksman like yourself. Well, madam. I did take quite a lot of damage there, it's true. No, my emotes would be, would be bad. Oh, we're back here again. Um, we'll go to the gun shop and see if anything's new there. Yeah, I heard a Rizzo Cat is the man to go to if you need help with emotes. Yeah, we'll get that. I don't know. If anyone else is having problems, let me know. Everything looks okay on my end. Bad, bounty hunter. Not bad at all. Now I reckon you could really line your pocket if you 
don't mind hunting down a woman. If you can call her a woman. Oh, okay. Twin revolvers. Yes, please. I thought we already had dynamite. Alright, whatever. Uh, so I always want to take a rifle for some reason. That I don't know about taking a shotgun, but I'll take a shotgun. I'll probably regret it though. We'll mix it up. You can jump very high. Should you join the Olympics or something? Oh, whoops, I pressed the wrong button. Having two guns instead of one is very nice. Yeah, it is weird, the quality settings on Twitch, yeah. I don't even know what determines that, or why that happens. It's weird. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I don't get that myself. Twitch is weird. It has some quirks, <laughs> for sure. high he's able to jump. Pretty amazing. Oh, dueling two guys at once. Is that the biggest chin I've ever seen in my life? That guy on the left? Holy frog. Then there we go, nice. Yeah, that's true, Fred. 
it has a lot of issues, but it, to be fair, they, you know, it is a complex site with a lot going on, it's true. Oh, it's our friend. <laughs> I just love, love that goofy lick on his face. It's pretty good. Uh, yeah, we'll buy that for sure. Follow me. I know a shortcut. Hey, T bag, welcome. Friend, you go ahead. I'll follow you. Die, please, no? Well, thanks, the guy took like eight bullets. <laughs> oh no, my favorite character just got killed. I wonder if I scripted or you can actually see it from there. The beef where I kind of just watched him get shot, you know? Oh, The Darkness 2. I actually quite liked that game. It was pretty good. I keep on pressing the wrong button. It's weird the dead eye on the bosses doesn't actually seem to do much damage. I guess they nerfed it so that it wasn't here, you see. Worst shotgun ever. There we go. We got there eventually. Thanks, Fred. You're too kind.
Yeah, dead. Skeptics. <laughs> hey, Wasteman, welcome. Yeah, this game came out in two hours and four. <laughs> nice. Uh, there's no new weapons. He, he just said after he got a new shipment then. He lied. Such a liar. Does it really take big balls to stream this game? Shotgun was a bit rubbish last time. I mean, take that out, I suppose. Waste man, thank you very much for the follow. Oh god, what has he got himself into? That that is Fry's telling lies. I never said I would do such a thing. Only if you're very nice to it, waste man, maybe. If you're talking to me, waste man, no, I never thought about the MF you two. Yeah, I think, uh. I think he does. I think Bob Crack is into that kind of thing. Nothing in here. I realize playing this game No the le the actual levels are very small in this game. That last one we did on the cliffs is actually probably the biggest one so far. At least it felt bigger anyway. I can't even jump out the window.
I wonder who he says the picture of on the wall. Probably a developer or something. Right, deserves to be global Twitch mod, I think. Hey, Heavy. Welcome. This is probably going to go very badly. <laughs> okay, this is going to go really badly. Okay. Oh shit. Yeah, I pressed the wrong button. Alright, oh, it's not the end. Oh. Still might die though. Does this have any ammo? Yeah, it does. Nice job, Fry. Repair these. Oh, right, thanks, Fred.
Oh, shit. I did not expect that. I don't know, I don't remember Frey. Very nice tea bag, enjoy. I'll probably wait for that to, for a, to have a price drop. Hey Dilly K, welcome. I'm doing well. I hope you are as well. Hey Ricky, <laughs> welcome. You're oh, it's no problem. I hope you did well with your job interview. Yeah, I think I was in uh, Tesco earlier and they were selling Far Cry 5 already. <laughs> they don't care. I wasn't lying when I looked like white slimer. That's a terrible looking note. God, not you too, Sam. <laughs> oh, thank you. You're far too kind. And I always press the wrong button. Take that, Dirk. you 
Oops, I walked into the fire. Like an idiot. Ricky Cook, thank you very much for the follow. Ooh. 2004 money. That's when this game came out. Just thought I would point that out. Oh, thanks. <laughs> I'm gonna die here. <laughs> What a crap way to die, that would be. Oh really, Fred? It doesn't surprise me if it, something like that would happen. I'm gonna die here. I can't remember what checkpointing's like in this. Oh, this is from the start, isn't it? Well, I can do all this way better anyway. Oh, a super shot? Nice. There's a guy around here somewhere. There we go. I got something for you. Come out. Play. <laughs> That's ridiculous. That's so over the top. It's hilarious. I forgot how bullet spongy people were in this game. They just take so much damage. Look, he's not even dead from that. I shot on him like a rocket launcher and he's still alive. What, what am I supposed to be doing? Like, I'm kind of missed that. Mm. 
we'll ride one of these, shall we? This is actually the first animal riding we've done so far. It's not a very big part of this game at all. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. Um, you can't just leave. Oh, there's someone out there somewhere. Alright, way off in the distance. Look at that. That's what I get for looking at chat instead of paying attention to what's going on. How do I get off? It said that it needs to be completely stopped. I mean, that's pretty... There we go. Thanks. I appreciate it. I'm trying to save your life and you run me over. Hey, that is. Well, this came out. Yeah, this came out before Red Dead Redemption, if that's what you mean. This is the original RDR. Artificial intelligence isn't very smart here. Just standing out in the open getting shot. and Holstein. That's what I'll name my first two children. Buff and Holstein. Good names. One R. Very nice. GG. Appreciate that. Oh, that's good, Tech Nine. You're making progress at least. At least you can hear me. That's a, that's an improvement. Yeah, I will be Ricky. I always watch him when he comes on. Ma'am. Do I know you, stranger? Tell me about the gold mine in Bear Mountain. I know nothing about a gold mine. You might want to take a trip on down to the saloon in Brimstone. It's always littered with a bunch of drunks yapping about it. But watch yourself, mister. You want no business with the folks in that town. This place is all I've ever known. Ma'am? 5,000 pieces in gold. This will help me keep my range. I haven't gotten an excellent in a while. Makes me feel bad.
just an arm? Well, maybe, but a cannon? Well, that's too much gun for any man. Ah, uh, cork your whiskey, Holmes. You didn't know him before like I did. Only a cannon could replace that man's arm. How'd he lose his arm? We ain't telling you nothing, stranger. Near as I can tell, we ain't even talking to you. <laughs> Take a walk. Answer my question, and I'll be on my way. Well, shut up. Don't tell the stinking prairie dog nothing. <laughs> Ain't that right, Sam? I reckon so. Say goodbye, mister. Oh, shit. <laughs> Not a good start. <laughs> Right, fight me then. Oh, look at this guy's kicking my ass. They just grab you out of nowhere. It's bullshit. At least you can give them a pimp slap every now and again, that's quite nice. Come on, pimp slap them. Ah, oh, see? I want to pimp slap them, then they just chuck me across the room. Pimp slap, there we go. There's no one for it. I need that health action. Slapping these guys, you know, taking cover on the wall, you know. <laughs> what? What was that? <laughs> what was that? I was in the middle of the pimp slap animation, and then he just punched me out of it. it was bullshit. Look, what the hell are they? He got out of it. He didn't take any damage. This is bullshit. Alright, let's throw a bottle. Let's crack a bottle at someone. I missed. Of course I did. I just used the bottle. I didn't know you could do this actually until I saw one of the enemies do it. It's like, yeah, that's that's a good idea. I should probably do it. Can these guys just die? Jesus Christ. I feel like I'm doing something wrong. <laughs> Oh nice, real tech nine GG. It's a shame you're watching like the worst part of the game so far, probably. Am I supposed to just go upstairs here and move on? Like, what's going on? Can I talk to these people? Oh, increase max health by getting into a buff. Seems good. Just like real life. 
<laughs> wow, the big brawls going on. Whoops. What's what's in the bedroom, eh? Maybe I can have a nap and increase my health or something. No, no. She died. Let's try this again. I'm just baffled by this th like whole situation. It makes no sense to me whatsoever. I'm gonna go upstairs. It's the first thing. No, I'm not actually. I'm gonna get chucked across the room. I was gonna say, let's go and uh, increase my health from the offset. Right, get out of my way. I've got more important things to do. Right, let's go down here. This is not good. I for completely forgot this part. I blocked this part of the game out of my memory for a reason. Right. We'll let them run upstairs. I think he's dead. Okay. No, he's not. He got off again. I thought when the blood came out, I thought it was kind of a sign that he might have died. Like that. But, no. Die. 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 Can this guy die? <laughs> You're wondering what this song is, but in the background, this little piano, crazy piano song. I wish I could tell you, Fry. Or Fred, rather. I thought it was Fry that did that for some reason. It seems like something Fry would do. It's a Fred approved song. Right. Hmm. See, I think this is a just me. What's the word? Making a prediction. But I think you need the bottles to kill them. See, I think I killed him there by throwing that bottle like that. No, I didn't. You still alive? Right, I've got two bottles here. Let's put them to good use. I can miss. This whole situation just uh, sucks. <laughs> Uh, the Gopho, I uh, played a little bit of it back in the day. I didn't think it was that great, but it was okay. I don't have it. I would need to buy it if I ever wanted to stream it. Megan's gonna die here. Come on, you must be dead. His hat flew off. What's this guy doing in here? He 
he's looking to get some action. Right, who's left? I can hear people. Is this a guy? Hiding in the corner. Well, what a crock of shit that was. <laughs> oh, really heavy? That's crazy. <laughs> yeah, that, GG, I guess, yeah. That was bad, though. <laughs> well, looky what we got here. Ah, it's that guy. If there's anything I can't stand. It's a varmint what don't know its own business. Thank you, Death Hiss. It's a fantastic run. World record pace. I wonder what the, if people do speed run this. And what the time would be for it. <laughs> Thanks, Fred. These faces are pretty funny as well. No. That's not how you're supposed to do it. <laughs> there we go. That's how you're supposed to do it. One hour, twenty three minutes, okay. Well, I'm way past that already, so unfortunately, this is not world record pace. Only three people ran it, I'm not surprised at all. Now the real show begins. You won't live long enough to see the show, Bounty Hunter. Oh my god. Punch me in the back. Thank you very much for the big host status, so I appreciate it. I'm on fire, I'm on fire. And not in a good way. No, you can't shoot those. What's the song? It's uh, Captain Save a Ho by E40. Wow, this guy's very strong. <laughs> Thanks for the hosts from Arizu Cat and uh, Houdini.
Mm, I've got nothing to, for him to run into. Maybe I have to use this stage. If you get my drift. Like, come on. Attack me. Save. Gaming genius. <laughs> Not really. Alright, okay. Just thanks, um This guy's just being a dick. There we go. We got there. All right there, bounty hunter. That's enough disturbing the peace for one day. Hand over the weapon. Thanks, Fred. I said hand it over. Look up in the sky. Thank you for the host of Blue Dandy Land. Such as yourself should know better than to stick his nose where it don't belong. Tell me about the one armed man. <laughs> What's it to you? Yes, they do, Ricky. Yeah. Killed my folks. Well, I'll be darned. I'd heard rumors you were alive, but never believed it. You're Nate Harlow's son, Ray. Tell me what you know about the death of my family. You see, it all happened about 12 years ago, when the U.S. Cavalry made a little incursion south of the border. Yeah, it is fun. It's very campy. And over the top. My guys have died already, so that's good. And I'm I'm nearly dead as well because I don't really know what I'm doing. Let's try that again. We'll take a different uh, approach here. Cause that just didn't work. 
let's uh, let's try something a bit different. Let's hang back. There's a lot of them. And they take down your health pretty good if, the, if you let them hit you. I was looking to see if I had something a bit faster. I can't go back anymore, if that's not clear. Hey Lukey Luke. I can't go back anymore, it's like an invisible wall there, it's pretty sucky. S yeah, I thought I'd mix it up and do a casual. More, more casual streams every now and again. I'm sucking balls in this level though. Doing really bad. Let's um try and cross the bridge. Completely intentional headshot. No luck involved there whatsoever. There we go. They do take a lot of hits. I don't remember uh, um, the enemies being so just bullet spongy, you know. Yeah, GTA 3 is pretty casual. You may notice in my community section underneath the stream, it it does say casual. <laughs> Good start. Now I need to kill some people in order to... No, maybe I don't need to do that actually. I was going to say, maybe I need to kill people to recharge my flare cannon shot ability. See, I can't actually even walk up there. That sucks. I hate invisible walls and guns. See you, Dattis. Have a good one.
I'm completely surrounded here. I saw that the flur kind of dips a little bit of a range. That's not true, Doth is. I uh, am a proper sub. I subbed. Legitimately. See, I need to see where that last cannon is. I think that's it there. No? Yeah, it is. There we go. I have to do all that again? Oh my god, this game sucks. No, I was enjoying it before, but not this level. I like the music in this game, Blood Swords. It's pretty good. I know a, lo a lot of it um, is licensed from like other movies and stuff, which I think is pretty cool.
I don't think that's something you would say to someone in the middle of a battle, Phil. You don't belong here. I don't know. I don't think they would say that either, but... That's not... Right, I'll focus on protecting these guys then. I think we did it. Good. Good, good, good. Yes, she would, Fred. Bye, Blue Dandelion. Sorry I didn't say goodbye to you, but yeah. I was too busy making sure that I uh, won, <laughs> rather than having to do all of that again. Thanks for it. Take him to the river and shoot him like a dog. No, no, no! I'm not a spy! I'm a businessman! Please! I was just trying to get across the river! Please! I have gold! Lots of gold! <laughs> you lied to save your pathetic life! No! It's true! It's true! I have gold! Bring him to me! It's lots of gold. More gold than you've ever seen. A gold mine. And it's just over the border in the territory. If you spare my life, I can give you half. Huh. Why shouldn't I take all of it? Because you don't know where it is. You better speak fast. We need some privacy. Now tell me more about this gold mine. Truth be told, there is one little problem. I only own half the claim. My partner Nate owns the other half. And what if I kill your partner? Then that would make us... partners. Partners. 
Oh dear. Where would I find this Diego? He rides through the territory to deliver gold to the governor once a week. He rests his horses at Devil's Fork. It won't be easy. That wagon is like a fortress on wheels. The charges are dropped. If you reckon you can bring him in, dead or... Well, dead will do. Probably do one more level and then uh, wrap it up for tonight. Uh, yeah, we'll purchase that. Why not? That's a nice hat with an eye on it. I'll buy that. Looks like a nice, yeah. I don't know. Uh, it's a nice mask. Okay. <laughs> we'll move on from that. We'll repair these. Yep. Press the start button and select the map. Oh, look at that. Yeah, it's kind of more open compared to the rest of the levels in this game. Most of the levels in this game are really small, but this one's a bit bigger. Here's our first actual horse. I'll steal it in a minute though, in a second. We're being raided. Yeah. That's exactly what Ricardo said earlier. He said exactly the same thing. And I think you're both right. I do agree. I think they're supposed to be scars, but yeah. Am I supposed to be shooting the stage, guys? Yeah. My health is not looking so good. 
<laughs> Didn't know that could, that could happen. Some sort of like health would be good. I'm just looking around to see if there is any, but hey, where do you come from? There we go, dead. Rip Cold crack. <laughs> nice. I have to say the the checkpoints in this game aren't the best. <laughs> Excuse me. I don't know exactly what happened there, but I'll roll with it. He did like a weird glitch up into the air kind of thing. I wonder, can I uh, throw my fireball? Oh, yeah, I can. That might be an idea. There's health if I ever need it. And practice it on this guy. Way more awkward than it should be. It says something in the load, like when I died, it says something about the driver, something about the driver, so I've been shooting him more. Or at least trying to.
There we go. Hey, Dark. Unfortunately, you came at a bad time because I'm going to end. <laughs> I'm going to wrap it up now. Oh, a weapon upgrade. Nice. Very, very nice. Um, I'll hit continue. We'll get a glimpse of what's the what's coming up. It's quite a good uh, place to end it off, though. It's dramatic. The protagonist has been captured, and we have to rely on this guy to save him. My fathers, I have news. What is it, Shadow Wolf? Cousin Red is alive. I saw the devil Diego taken prisoner to the mines. You must help him then. Go, Shadow Wolf, but beware of the ghost devil. I like games uh, back in the day when the cutscenes were like nice and short and to the point. Those were the days. So here's here's a glimpse. Got an arrow, got a knife. You know, it's gonna be quite different. I think this level compared to the other ones. You know. But anyway, thanks everyone for hanging out, and uh, yeah, um, I appreciate all the support as always, and uh, yeah, you guys are awesome. So yeah, thanks for all the hosts and all the follows and all that kind of stuff. I appreciate every one uh, of those, and yeah, I'll see you guys soon in the near future. Thanks everyone. Bye.